Hi, this is Nikki with Mystic Illuminations, and I'm here to give you a goddess reading for the planet transit Venus going into Gemini. I'm going to do this as an elemental reading, so I'm going to do all four elements, and I'm going to just point out what goddess energy we can invoke for this special transit with Venus entering Gemini. So I'm going to start with the air tribe, so Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. What goddess will be protecting you and supporting you and guiding you through this transit? Okay, um, before I pull this goddess for you, Air, I want to let everyone know that the transit does happen July 4th until July 30th. And Air, the goddess here, is White Tara. So you got to honor your emotions. You got to honor your sensitivity. Um, there could be some harsh relationships, um, situations, or even chemicals that, you know what I mean, your body is having. So honor your sensitivity through this air. Honor your um, cycles of knowing that maybe you got to slow down on certain things. So it's just kind of like a moderation. But know that it's not a complete stop. Just know that you have a balance um, and avoid, you know, things that make you feel like you're being in a harsh environment, whether it's people or um, feelings of, you know, being in a certain environment and not feeling like it is welcoming. So just know that you are going to be sensitive in this transit, but also um, it's going to be very positive because White Tara is here to definitely give you support in that. So call upon her if you feel that way. And this transit is going to really give you a lot of peace and a lot of, um, you know, cleansing vibes for this. Next, we're going to do water. And water, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. What goddess is for you in this transit is Isis. Yes, this is about your past life. This is going to be really a memory that's going to spark something that's going to give you your a you know, a divine message through this. So you're a divine channeler yourself. Water signs, know that Isis is really kind of giving you this past life recognition and uh, you're recognizing these emotions for a reason and it's really going to help you um, communicate your heart and communicate like how you feel in your depths of your soul. Um, especially with this um, transit, we all really got to speak our truth and uh, speak our true desires to get what we deserve and to get what we truly desire and what we truly deserve is really just being in love with ourselves and knowing what we truly want. So next I'm going to do Earth. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Sekhmet. And this is saying be strong. You're independent and you are supported. So, um, earth signs, you are a very strong sign. You're very earthly. You're very grounded, okay? And the world is yours. You have a um, really strong mind, but you really know that um, even with your mind being strong, your emotions are strong. And even when you're weak, that's a sign of strength. So, um, just know that you have a very strong, you have these two big lions by your side, and they're definitely supporting you in this. Venus in Gemini transit. So um, it's going to be a happy outcome for you. It's going to be um, that you are stronger than you think you are. You're going to really be going through some beautiful um, realizations and some beautiful uh, aha moments that are going to come in this transit. And it's going to be really good. It's going to build your strength for all the beautiful blessings to come for you, Earth. And next I have fire. Fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. And I'll give it a few more little swigs. Shuffle duffles, how I say. And Spirit wants to tell you that Mother Mary is letting you know to expect a miracle fire. So fire signs, this is um, Mother Mary, a representation of her holding the baby and letting you know that, you know, have faith. You have prayers that have been heard. Um, they are being answered. 
So expect a miracle in this transit. Know that you are supported. Um, know that uh, the Divine Mother Mary is here with you. So if you want to call upon her, um, know that her really um, miracle-making ways can happen instantly for you. Just put your faith in her. Put your faith in um Whoever that makes you feel comforted like a mother. So um, if it's your mother or someone like a mother figure, if you don't necessarily want to pray to Mother Mary, but whatever it is, it's a very mothering, nurturing feeling. So that's going to be really great for you, Fire. I think that that is um, really what is needing for you to ignite your true heart's desires and passion. So know that there is that miracle coming for you. And um, I do want to do for everybody... Um, a goddess. Okay, so I do want to pull a goddess card for all 12 signs. And I'm, and also, um, I want to pull a goddess card for all of us that represent all 12 signs. That's what I meant. And I am going to also do a, a separate reading from this to get break down the signs a little bit more. And I wanted to do a goddess reading for your elements. Because I think sometimes the elements are supported really strongly by certain goddesses. And it's great to, to bring those up and to show their um, love. And we have Maeve. She's saying that we got to uh, really honor our cycles and rhythms. She's dancing barefoot. She has a beautiful walking stick that's kind of like leading her in that direction. She's showing that she's honoring her body and energy levels and emotions. So in this transit... We really have to honor our body. We have to honor our rhythms, um, whether we're feeling like an emotional roller coaster or we're feeling we just want to get up and dance. We're, we're feeling we want to um, express ourselves in a physical way, um, whether we put it into sports or we put it into walking or jogging or just, um, you know what I mean, practicing your breathing. I mean, anything to do with the cycle and rhythm a feeling like um, getting yourself into the motions of um, creating space. And when you create space, you honor the emotions, you honor the uh, situations that can really create a space for you to uh, open up a divine channel to get uh, the true blessings that are meant for you. So thank you so much for being here. I want to just send you so much love and light, and I'm sending you a bunch of Reiki all the way through this uh, reading. I've been giving you Reiki in every element, and um, all the signs are supported in this beautiful transit. Uh, the goddess is here. Um, she hears you. Um, like I say, the goddess is here, and um, they know that you're reaching out to them when you do, so do it. Uh, it's nothing but to do it and know that you are supported in every way possible. Have a wonderful Venus and Gemini transit. And I will see you next time on Mystic Illuminations. This is Nikki. Goddess bless and mystical, mystical love and light.